very, very important to prepare. Get ready for your workout. Get the blood flowing and raise the heart rate. Be the best you can be. Let's absolutely smash this 21 day challenge. Herbalife family, welcome back. Now today we are going to be doing the core circuit. Now, why is core so important? Listen, you use it in every single thing you do. I take for granted how much I use it, particularly in gymnastics and my sport. And making this stronger is gonna enhance everything. You know, people with back problems, this is gonna really, really help. We need, we all need a strong core. So today we've got another circuit for you guys. We're gonna be doing 45 seconds work. 15 seconds rest with eight exercises. So it's gonna be eight minutes in total. Very, very challenging. And the last exercise, we've leave a little present for you to really finish that core off. So exercise number one, Bob standard. We've done it before in these workouts is gonna be the standard plank. Now what I would do if you find this too easy, standard plank, you shouldn't do for 45 seconds. Just bring your arms a little bit forward so we make it into a bit of a long plank. That's gonna make the core work even harder. If you find it too challenging, again, just knees on the floor, go at your pace. Exercise number two is gonna work back the lower chain and the glutes. So we're gonna flip over and do the bridge raises. Again, 45 seconds work, 10 seconds rest. Again, to make it more challenging, hands off the floor. Easy, hands on the floor. Exercise number three is gonna be the bicycle, so staying onto the back. We're gonna be going hands on our head, knee started up, and we're gonna go alternate knee for 45 seconds. And again, if we can go at a pace, that's better. If not, just go at your pace, slow, controlled, really working the core. Number four is gonna be the full crunch. So we're gonna stay with our knees in the air again, and we're just gonna have hands on the back of the head and crunch all the way up. You should feel a really solid burn at the top of the crunch on your abs the whole way up. Again, it's gonna be 45 seconds work. It's gonna be really, really challenging, specifically targeting that front chain. Number five, we're gonna flip over again for the posterior and we're gonna work the arch. So on your belly, arms out straight and we're just gonna hold the arch position, really activating the glutes, the hamstrings, the lower back. You're gonna be working the shoulders in this as well. Really, really challenging exercise. Number six, Back to the plank, but this time we are gonna be going feet raises. So one leg, alternate leg, one at a time, lifting up. Again, make it slightly easier. You can have your knees on the floor and squeezing the glutes, feet go up. Back to the bridge, we're gonna stay up in the raised position. And again, we're just gonna go alternate leg. It's gonna make it really, really challenging for the glutes. We want to keep the hips in the straight position. We don't want them to drop. We don't want the bum on the floor, very level. Switching legs. <laughs> Easier option, put your hands down. If you find it even too challenging, just literally hold the bridge and make sure you're activating the glutes. And the final one, the challenging one, it's gonna be 45 seconds worth of the dish position. So again, hiding those ears with the shoulders, everything in a straight line, feet and shoulders off of the floor. And that's really gonna finish off our core. Let's get into the workout. So let's get into the circuit. I have Sibel, wonderful assistant, who again is gonna be doing the more basic versions of each exercise. So if you need to, follow along with her. We're gonna start with the plank, 45 seconds. Let's smash it. Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. So again, I would challenge you to just bring your arms slightly forward if you do find the plank position easy really remember keeping it in that straight line. In 45 seconds, it's, it's a challenging time, so this is really gonna push you. The core should burn, even for myself. Okay. Keeping the body in a straight line, squeezing the glutes, just activating the lower abs. Legs tight. Pushing guys, we've got 10 seconds left, and we have a 15 second break. Three, two, one, and relax. Good. So we're gonna turn over, we've got the bridge raises. So our feet. Again, so we'll have our hands on the floor. If you can, hands on your chest or just raised. We're gonna start. Three, two, one, and go. Up and down. Up and down. Squeezing the glutes, hamstrings. Yeah, you want those hips completely in line with the knees at the top. Good. 
going through the group. Yes, activating the lower back as well. Keep pushing, guys, keep pushing. 10 seconds remaining. Never keep up this pace. And three, two, one, and relax. The next exercise, we're going to stay on the back and we're going to go to the bicycles. So Sibel is going to go it at her own pace very slow. Again, I'd say if you need to stop at any point in this, do so. I would endeavour to keep up with the whole thing. So we're going to start in three, two, one, knees raised and alternate arm, alternate leg. You're going to go at your pace, guys. Endeavour to keep working for the 45 seconds. Just really, really feel this in the core. Keep the pace up. You should feel the burn now, just keep working through it. It's important. And three, two, one. And the last 15 seconds, so we're going to be challenging now, going straight into the crunch. So we've gone from core to core, so this is going to really, really feel the burn. And when we crunch to the top, we need to feel the abs contract. So ready to start, hands on the back of the head. And three, two, one, crunch. So squeeze at the top, feel it burn, it's just a deep burn. Any point guys, if you need to stop, you can do. The goal is to keep working for that 45 seconds. Here we go, we've got the burn now. <laughs> Come on, keep going. Come on, Sibel. Keep fighting, feel the crunch at the top, crunch. Keep going, keep going, keep going, crunch. And three, two, one, and relax. Feel that. <laughs> so we're gonna flip over onto the front now. So we're gonna give the core, the abs a rest and work on the arch position so it's lower back and glutes. It's just gonna be hold for 45 seconds. So again, challenging exercise, ready? Three, two, one, and go. And Sabelle's gonna put our hands on the back of the head which makes it slightly easier. If you can do, keep up with me. Obviously, you're going to be working the shoulders a little bit more with your arms straight and locked out. You'll feel a nice burn through your glutes and your bum, your lower back. Really squeeze everything head to foot, guys. You're going to endeavour to stay here for 45 seconds. Keep working, keep working. Feel burn all the way through your back. We've got 10 seconds, keep fighting. Shoulders should be burning, glutes should be burning. And three, two, one, and relax. It's a really, really challenging circuit, great for the car. Next is going to be plank feet raises. So Sibel again is going to go on her knees, alternate leg up and down. Ready? Three, two, one, and so feet raises. Again, Sibel on her knees to make it slightly easier. If you need to put a cushion under your knees, Try not to tilt each side. We want to keep the core solid as you possibly can. Have your legs slightly apart to make it easier. Keep moving. Squeeze the glutes. Remember that body in a straight line, that solid plank. 10 seconds, keep fighting. To go and three, two, one, and relax. Woo! So we're gonna flip over again. And we're gonna be doing the bridge raise alternate legs. Sibel's just gonna hold the bridge raise. Again, try and keep up with the two of us. We're ready? Three, two, one, and up. So I'm gonna be doing alternate legs. Again, trying not to let the hips drop. You know, we want to keep them steady in line with the knees the whole time. Just 
such simple exercises you really, really feel. By now you should be feeling how strong or weak your core is. Got 10 seconds left, keep going guys. Keep working for the 45 seconds. And three, two, one, relax. So we've got the last one, the dish. 15 seconds rest, and this should really, really finish us off. Hopefully you're feeling the burn. Sabelle's gonna demonstrate the easier exercise, hands under the bum, and I'm gonna have arms behind my ears, hiding your ears. Are you ready? Three, two, one, and oh. Come on, guys. 45 seconds, just give it everything you got. Challenging for myself. Keep pushing, keep pushing. Come on, Sibel. <laughs> keep fighting, keep fighting, keep fighting. Ten seconds left. If you need to come down, come down. We're gonna fight all the way through. Come on, push. <laughs> Again, it doesn't matter. Just keep going. Uh, three, two, one. Ah! <laughs> awesome guys so there you have it the core workout for this 21 day challenge i will see you tomorrow i'm incorporating this in my day-to-day -day routine and you can all these products taste absolutely incredible so again getting that in your daily routine is important and it's all about creating again healthy habits over these next 21 days